pollution and diversity is about being able to bring your whole self, every part of you, your culture, your language, your religion, the color of your skin, all of these things to wherever you are and not just being accepted, but being understood and being celebrated for the difference that you bring and the value in that difference. That's what I think inclusion truly is. So here at Multicultural Australia, we talk about changing the conversation and the conversation we seek to change is very much about inclusion, diversity and connection. And it's key to the work that we do every day. Australia is made up of many cultures, many people with many backgrounds, many languages. And we have come a very long way in creating an inclusive country where we celebrate our diversity. Diversity should be celebrated and seen as a key strength of any community, as a driver for inclusion. And for inclusion, I guess it's an innate sense of welcome and belonging in any setting. Well, inclusion and diversity to me is about providing an opportunity and environment where everyone is truly seen and heard and can participate freely. Um, it means there's an open and an authentic sharing of ourselves and a conversation about our differences in a way that allows us to truly appreciate, accept and grow. I think our country provides a beautiful multicultural landscape where we have a unique opportunity to learn and grow from one another. Not being the one with the accent and let me explain that to you a little bit more. So very early on when in my time at Multicultural, when I started, the staff member explained to me why she was so happy to work here. She explained that English was not her first language and that she had worked in the past in an industry where as a non-native English speaker, she really stood out. So when people were referring to her and they didn't know her name or weren't sure about who she was, they would often say, what is that lady with that accent's name again and she felt really singled out by that. So when she came to Multicultural Australia, she all realised very quickly that we all have accents and she's not the only one. So um, now finally she has found her family and her home and she, hasn't, she isn't that lady with the accent anymore.